The Hancock County Sheriff's Office is receiving a nearly 18% budget increase from $1.9 million to $2.3 million for the upcoming year, which the county hopes will help as state police pull back their patrol coverage throughout the county. We used to have a 50-50 agreement, uh, and that agreement is now that we do two-thirds and they do one-third. Very slim pool of people out there getting into law enforcement and applying for law enforcement. You have to obviously have a competitive wage and benefit package. The sheriff's office says the additional money will primarily be used to increase wages as well as pay for overtime and officer training. Sheriff Kane says more than anything, he needs positions filled. I did not end up with any new additional uh, personnel in my patrol division or as detectives. On top of that, he says he is concerned with the state of the drug task force program, which he says is short-staffed due to prior funding cuts. The budget committee wanted to fund positions in there, but the commissioners cut them. So in this day and age, with the amount of drugs that are on the street, uh, we should have agents down there. We should. According to the Hancock County Commissioners, there has been no decrease in the level of support for the program, and they remain dedicated to supporting the staffing issues. Commissioner William Clark said in a statement, quote, For the 2024 budget year, we commissioners have informed the MDEA that if they fund, hire, and train the fourth agent, we will fund the fifth one, provided an officer gets assigned to the task force and is up and fully operational. We just assure the, the citizens of Hancock County that they, we will respond to their complaints in a timely manner, and we will do everything we can with funds that we have. Grace Blanchard reporting for ABC7 and Fox 22 News.